Okay, today we're going to be solving exponential inequalities. So these are very similar to when we solve um, exponential equations. Um, so say we had inequality 2 to the power x greater than 3. We would take the logarithm of both sides of the inequality. We can take logarithms to any base, but care must be taken with inequality symbols when do so. doing so. So if the base of the logarithm is greater than 1, the inequality symbol remains the same. If the base of the log is between 0 and 1, the inequality symbol is reversed. This is because if you have log y equals log ax, it's an increasing function for a greater than 1, but it's a decreasing function for a between 0 and 1. Hence, when taking logs to base 10, both inequality, both an inequality and inequality symbol remains unchanged. Um, also to note, if we divide both sides of an inequality by a negative number, the inequality symbol is reversed. Okay, so let's solve 0 0.6 to power x less than 0 0.7 and we're going to um, give the answer in terms of base 10 oops log and that's not a useful answer but never mind so we're going to take the log of both sides so we'll have log 0 0.6 x less than the log of 0 0.7 and we're going to use the power rule And that will then give us x is less than 0.7. Oh, right. I'm going to get rid of that. So I'm going to, we've got this here. And we're going to divide by log 0 0.6. Now, if you put log 0 0.6, log base 10 0 0.6 into your calculator, it is less than um, 0. It's negative. So we've just divided both sides by a negative number. So if we divide both sides of a negative number, we flip the inequality sign. Um, and if we then were to actually solve this, it would be 0 0.6. 9, 8 to 3 significant figures. Okay, so by looking at it, just solving it through mathematically, you don't, you might not be able to know that that is actually going to be a negative number you're dividing by. So when you're doing these, check that what you're doing the dividing with, if it's positive or negative, um, just so you don't 
slip up there. <coughs> Let's do another one. So we're going to solve 4 times 3 to the power 2x minus 1 greater than 5. And we're just going to leave it in terms of a base 10. So we're going to divide both sides by 4 which is not a negative number, so we're fine. Now we're going to log it. And now we can use the power rule. And we'll expand the bracket. Oh, I forgot the log. Minus log 3 greater than log 5 over 4. And now we will take this over. And now we'll divide by log 3. So I was right up here. So 2x. And we'll divide by 2 as well. So x is going to be greater than log 5 over 4 plus log 3 all over 2 log 3. Now we can do the power rule to get rid of that. So 2 will come here and it'll be 3 squared, which will be 9. And that is going to be our answer in terms of log base 10. So I hope that helps.